Hello, everybody. I know I'm a little late. Um, by a little late, I mean like about a full day late. Um, but I I know that this trailer kind of popped off. Everyone's kind of talking about it. Uh, I don't know anything about Hawkeye Impact is what I heard that this trailer is uh, heavily referencing. There's a lot of references to Hawkeye Impact because the stories are aligned. And I believe it is now confirmed through this uh, trailer, maybe, that um, May from Honkai Impact is Acheron from, uh, from HSR. Um, honestly, I don't know anything about Honkai Impact. As you can see, uh, genuinely, I have not watched this whole thing. I got about 20 seconds into it or whatever. We're probably going to find out whenever I click on it. Then I was like, oh, wait. Um, I should probably watch this whenever I have some time and I watch it with, uh, uh, watch it as a reaction for the channel. Uh, so I'm excited to get into this. Uh, unfortunately I kind of forgot that it existed and now it is 2.42 AM and I work tomorrow it happens. Uh, you win some, you lose some, uh, let's get into it. Send it here. Okay. Yeah. 20 seconds. Exactly. Wow. Let's go. It's going to be epic. Still why Izumo forged these blades? Now I'm to believe I'm to believe that this is Acheron. Times past, when the Yao Yorozu no Kami descended here. Okay, that, that sounds like her voice. They brought death and disaster on this world and its people. To save the world, Izumo. Is this her black? What? Uh, uh, this is. Is this her black and white form that she goes into? That and wherever her strikes become red. Uh, during like her alt or whatever, because this is badass. These visuals are 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 stunning. Splintered so far, Hunkai Sarrel will never ever disappoint seconds. with a trailer. I I just don't believe it'll ever happen until I see it. The first was truth forged by the sovereign of revelation. Okay. It teach mortals the way of the law and create miracles from the deconstruction of all things. That's kind of badass. It's Attack on Titan. Forged by the eternal zenith, it could form a barrier from the firmament and prevent the innumerable gods of misery from passing through. Nice. The third was Howl, able to summon lightning to rend the heavens and meteors to rain down the divine punishment. The fourth was That's not what she uses, right? Able to break earth and tear cloud with biting wind and rain. I like that. I like the look of that one. The fifth was Frost, freezing the land. In an instant. Jing Liu. The sixth was fate. The restless cycle of life and death. Then there was flare. Thaw. Root. Form. Bind. Maw. With those sentinels, we seized on tomorrow's expectation. Winning victory after victory. Until... All of them were broken. Huh? The price of every victory was a world in its entirety and in the end no that entirety was lost don't die and so izumo i have to pull you sentinels and like i got like five days till your banner comes out the first was origin the second was end oh my the world forged seventy thousand and forty seven blades and only could save Izumo. But you and I both know the road to salvation does not exist. So Akron uses Origin. Resisting the Kamigami, humanity will eventually become Oni. We pawned everything more for the destruction of two worlds. In times past, Takamagahara, upon which the Kami descended, was surely as beautiful as Izumo. She sliced it! So, do you still remember why Izumo forged these blades? Because of a lie. An end that never existed. Wow. We long since strode into their shadow. Each step forward. Oh, this character is so cool. Until the last blade is forged into. Oh, this is hers. Not. She uses not.
Yeah, okay. That's what I was used to. I, I was wondering, I was like, okay. I thought this was supposed to be her form whenever she goes into like the black and white mode. But I've never seen the I've never seen the horns, right? And that and the hair was like white. But here, there you go. <laughs> the hair is now white or like a, a very light blonde and she has no horns, which is this is and her sword is red, which all of her slashes are red. This is exactly how she looks in uh whenever she uses her all. It's so cool. I really, really like the art style of this cinematic. This was very, very cool. I knew this world was fleeting. Holy flashbang, dude. And yet. And yet. Wow. Cool. <laughs> awesome. It's, it, it's so cool. Uh, yeah, um, that was a trailer for sure. I, I already decided from last trailer, well, I, I kind of had a feeling ah, I might pull for her whenever I started watching videos that people were making. Then I watched the first trailer come out and I was like, all right, now I have to kind of like, kind of, you know, like I'm really, really, really thinking about it. I, yeah, I thought, I thought I'm, I'm probably going to do it. And then this trailer comes out. I mean, like. I'm already kind of solidified, but I'm definitely solidified now. I am definitely pulling for Acheron. Be there or be square when it happens. I think we got like five days till that banner comes out. Five days till Acheron drops. That's right. That's right. Thank you all for watching. I hope that you enjoyed this trailer as much as I did. Uh, I would under I understand if this video gets like barely any views. Or anything because this was quite late and that's my fault so thank you all for watching if you did watch and i really appreciate you subscribe if you haven't already it means a lot and um yeah like the video comment your thoughts on the cinematic peace